Hello, Cancer. Thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support, and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. Excuse me. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity, what messages do you have for a sign of cancer? Please and thank you. <clears throat> okay. And Gemini just literally got this in the same exact spot. So you guys have some good news that is your way. It's going to get you really excited about something. Okay, so your challenge is the chariot, which is your card, your major arcana card here. If you're not known for anything else, cancers are known for the chariot. So you may be allowing other people to influence your actions here. And that can ultimately cause you to miss out on something. But with the two of pentacles, I'm seeing that like, yeah, high priestess in reverse, not trusting your own intuition, not trusting the guided messages that you're receiving here. So you guys could continue to struggle with how to prioritize a particular situation or how to like make something happen because you're you don't know how you can even make time for it overall energy is a page of swords someone could be spying on someone else because it looks like uh, you guys are on a break for some um on a break from someone it looks like someone is spying on someone while someone is focusing on their healing they're trying to recover from a particular situation particular breakup and someone wants to know what is going on in that person's life. <clears throat> Why is the two of pentacles here? Yeah, overcoming. Okay, so someone could um, be deciding whether they should give to a particular situation after they just overcome, overcame something really, something really difficult here. Whether it was a divorce, a loss, betrayal. But Six of Pentacles, someone wants to give to someone else. So either someone is struggling to accept something or to give something here. Emperor, yes. Someone is trying to figure out like, when is the best time to make their move and what move should they make? So someone is sitting back contemplating like their actions. What should they do next? But I'm really getting someone's wanting to make a move on you unless you're wanting to do this to someone else. But because I'm getting like someone, someone is excited to message you or to express how they feel about you. And I'm getting that you'll be really excited to hear from this person or to find out how they truly feel about you. Ultimately, I do see that this will be an equal give and take type of relationship. But initially, it may be a little difficult for um, you guys to find that much time to spend with one another because it looks like the both of you are pretty busy. That's the only issue I'm really seeing here. Okay, messages for cancers who are in a relationship. Messages for the Cancers who are in a relationship. Okay, so whoever you're in a relationship with, they, they want to show you how much they truly love you. And it looks like they're going to do that by giving you a ring. Or you're doing this to someone else. But I definitely see this relationship going to the next level. Um... So if that's something you were concerned about. 
Yeah, if some of you guys were wondering whether whether the person you're with, if they're still into you, they are definitely still into you and they're about to show you. Yeah, this is going to be a shock. It was supposed to be a surprise. <laughs> but because some of you guys could have thought that your relationship was approaching this ending, but it's actually approaching a new beginning here. Okay, messages for the cancers who are in separation from their person. I hope I haven't been calling y'all Gemini. Messages for the cancers who are in separation from their person. Okay, so this person is not revealing to you how they truly feel. But they definitely look at this situation between you and them as like a soulmate. Someone that they definitely feel deeply connected to. What's the most likely outcome <clears throat> between Cancer and this person? You know, I'm going to tell you what. Either you or this person feel like there's something better out there for them and they want to keep their options open. I'm getting, I don't know which one of you guys this is, but I am leaning more towards the person that you're dealing with. And even though, yes, they do feel like you are a soulmate, they do feel like two of you have something uh, very special together, but they don't feel like you're their twin flame. Meaning they feel like there's someone else out there that they're truly meant to be with and they don't feel like you're that person. So they want to keep their options open. Be mindful because this person could end up stringing you along. And while they're still searching for the person that they feel is out there for them. So I don't, I'm getting like this person feels, unless this is you, Cancer, but I'm getting that someone feels like this deep sensation that there's someone out there that they're meant to be with and they feel like they have yet to meet that person. So that's why they continue to keep their options open. Okay, messages for single cancers, please and thank you. Messages for single cancers. Okay, so you guys need to break free of some sort of outdated thinking here that gets you, continues to put you in positions where you are charmed and used by someone else. Um, part of the issue is you're needing to feel more comfortable with establishing boundaries when it comes to your relationships. And more than likely, the reason why you don't feel comfortable with establishing boundaries is because of how you were raised. someone chasing after you but it looks like the person that's chasing after you is a uh, karmic karmic so some of y'all are definitely needing to work through some healing here yeah to make healthier choices because it's not like you don't have options you definitely do have options but you tend to attract like toxic energies and it's because of what you're needing to work out within yourself outdated thinking you continue to attract the same type of energy just through different people let's get messages regarding new love new love coming towards um cancer new love coming towards cancer okay so you guys are this is coming with you focusing on your healing. Uh, there's a new you rising from the ashes. From the ashes. Um, so that means like the old version of you has to completely be destroyed in order for this new version of you to be uh, to emerge from the ashes here. You have love coming in. There is someone who's going to steal your heart away. You will be struck by love. It's not giving too much information on this person. 
of her pain that's coming through after some sort of major transformation that's taking place in your life. But I do see whoever is coming towards you with this new love energy, if you're resonating with this transformation type of energy that's taking place within someone's life, um, <clears throat> whoever this is that's coming towards you is someone who's going to make you extremely happy. I definitely see like the two of you going the distance with one another. could be unemployed or you're just not making enough money as your current job I'm getting like part of the issue is you needing to release what just isn't working for you but you continue to oh who some of y'all could have some strong um who else? I think Gemini. Yeah, some of y'all still have some strong Gemini place, placements. Are you on the cups here? Overall, <clears throat> you got the sun and then nine of wands wanted to show up too. Overall, energy is the devil and... The Five of Wands in reverse. It could be someone trying to influence other people to create like drama, chaos for people to fight at a particular job. But it looks like as much as this person, like they truly want to influence a particular situation, but not for not for good like they want to see people fight they want to see people at each other's throat but it looks like if it has been working it looks like it's not going to be working for long because it looks like everyone's about to start getting along with one another and learning to work like decent human beings i want to know because you guys could definitely be struggling financially i'm getting for someone here but let's see why is the Five of Pentacles here? I'm getting with a particular situation. You guys could have felt like your worst nightmare became your reality. You guys could have been outcasted if you are still employed or some of you guys were fired. And of course, it's, it's, it has influenced your finances. Because with Page of Wands, this is not good news. This is not the type of news that you want to hear. It's also like it's very discouraging too. So you guys could be struggling to have faith in the universe, to have faith in the divine at this moment. But I do see like you coming out on top regardless. And you will find your happiness again if this is the case. With the King of Cups here, like you have uh, the ability to smooth things over in your life, but also like with you being placed in this King position, so that means that you will be in the powerful position. So if anything didn't work out and it was because like someone wanted to create drama, they wanted to make your life more difficult, they may for a moment feel like they were successful, but that's not going to last long. Like you will find your happiness again. Things will smooth uh, smooth out for you. So don't allow whatever is going on to get the best of you because that, that's going to um, smooth out very, very shortly for you. Breaking free of something with the distant horizons. <clears throat> Ch 
challenge is the lovers. Outcome is marriage. You got main male here. So some of y'all definitely have a relationship coming in. Yeah, I put that back in and wants to come out. Who? It looks like you guys will no longer be bound to something. And that doesn't mean like relationship. It doesn't mean like a um, particular job. But it's just something here that you feel like has been holding you back. Whatever you feel like has been holding you back, you will finally feel like you are free of it. Like you have been set free from this, whatever it is. Why is the lovers um, in the challenge position? message so someone struggling to express the way they feel about you someone who could quite possibly live at a distance because it's a journey to get uh through to you or the environment that the two of you are in like they can't get through to you where you guys are where you initially meet this person but this is someone who definitely sees a long relationship evolving between the two of you you guys could work together or this is something that the both of you are just going to work on. But I do see if you're a male, you have your eyes on someone and it looks like you and this person, this particular relationship, it looks like things will work out between the two of you. But if you're a female, it looks like this male um, it has their eyes set on you. And I mean like feminine, masculine energy. So... I'm going to leave it there. I'm not really getting much out of this except for a relationship that could quite possibly change your life. But it looks, if if it's not distance, literal, literal distance between you and this person, it's the fact that they feel like they can't get through to you where the two of you meet initially. So like they'll have to be creative with how they express themselves to you or how they reach out to you. I'm going to leave it there. These are the messages that came through. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment. This reading resonates. But with that being said, you all take care.